Hi everyone. We got something a little bit different today. Today, we are going to be boxing an arcade machine. This one comes all the way from Japan. Now there's a few people who already know what I ordered, but we're gonna open it up here. And you guys are gonna get to see how it is. I have not seen this yet, so. I'm praying like heck that this survived the trip and that it was well packaged. Folks that buy usually do a pretty good job at packing. So, this will be fun. Give me a bubble wrap. Putting a bubble wrap on the side. This is the first whole bags of packing peanuts. <laughs> that's an, that's actually a new one. I've not had packages like this. I'm going to keep those. Packing peanuts are pretty good for for shipping things. You know what? We're just gonna. This is a pretty thick box, actually. Do this number. Pretty good job packing this. Wow. With how heavy they quoted it being, I thought it was going to be crated. But no, they they went all out with the packing material on the inside. And you guys get to watch me struggle with it. I can only imagine how bad the noise might be. But I only get one shot at this, so. Put that there so I don't cut myself. Cause oh man, would that be fun. You can see the headlines now. Man bleeds out while trying to open up an arcade machine. Looking at it, it survived the trip, at least the glass did. These corner, God, these corner pieces are all rusty. But the table itself seems to be in good shape. One solid piece here. You guys can probably see it now, but this is Nintendo Head on N. It's a pretty rare birdie, but um, it's one I kind of really wanted. You guys might know that I have been putting together an upright. Well, I saw one pop up for sale, a real one and said, hey, wouldn't it be cool if I got a real one instead? All right. Well, I'm going to cut away now, and I'm going to pull this out of the box because, yeah, we're going to be here for a minute. All right, before I unpack this even more, I just want to show you the attention to detail these packers did or made. Not only was the whole thing filled with bubble wrap, they even did the table, the table legs, and wrapped the whole body in bubble wrap. This thing's actually in pretty good shape. <sighs> All right. This thing's actually pretty dirty. I can see all the grime inside this thing had water at some point it looks like just 
based on the couple hints that are just where and was no it was pretty close to the ocean so that might have been it so i'm gonna cut away for just a moment while i go fetch a key for this all right a key has been acquired this was actually from my space fever but this should work with this going off memory nintendo use these number 200 locks by tachygen oh they did okay so we're gonna take a peek inside this is my first time seeing in here so let's hope that it's nice all right oh this thing is filthy oh my goodness gracious Well, that is really unfortunate. There's all sorts of grime. It almost looks like rodents were in here. So, but the good news is that everything is here. I was really hoping that the manual would be in here. But, um,. I didn't quite get luck. I didn't get quite that lucky. All the paperwork's gone on the top too. Like I said, it almost looks like there was rodents in here at some point. Oh God! Oh wow! Look at that. You can just see the mouse nest in there. Ah, oh, boy. <laughs> I. What's funny is they turned this on. Apparently, this game works. They, they, in the pictures, they turned it on, and it showed a picture. So, we're going to find out, I guess. Um, so, yeah. Now, that's going to be something. This is going to be one heck of a project. <laughs> oh man so the good news is that it's not hard to pull everything out in this machine so I'll be able to clean this up and heck I'll probably post some uh some videos when I finish up all the work so or maybe even as I'm doing it who knows anyway well, thanks for watching. Thanks for um, unboxing this, for sticking with me while I unbox this thing. All right. Wish me luck. Thanks.